All right, boys and girls, this is a Caterpillar 303.5 E2 mini excavator. And as you can see, there's not much to it. There's nothing in the engine compartment except lots of engine, nothing to catch. If you open up the fuse panel, as shown right here, you will need a key. Unlock this, and you'll have plenty of room. There's also a main harness. Caterpillar is great about making their red constant 12 and their yellows are switched ignition. So you can hit this with a posi tap, poke and wrap, whatever your choice is. Bundle your fuses up, of course. Self tap a ground down in the bottom. There's our ground self tap in that metal plate. Everything works good. Zip tie everything tight to where it's not shaking. It's real important in machinery to not have stuff just loose. That's okay like that, no problem at all. We've just tied everything together, our excess cable, and we've mounted our box at an angle, which is fine. This is an open cab. It'll get good GPS. So um, camera angle doesn't do any good, but you can also see where our lights are flashing. And as you can see, we've got a great GPS signal. Green light, of course, telling you how many satellites and orange light blinking away, communicating with the network with the key in the off position right now. There you have it. That's your Caterpillar. It's about a 15 minute install from start to finish.